We are in uncharted waters right now and attempting to navigate them faithfully. Before the outbreak of COVID-19 and the need for social distancing and self-isolation, we had made the very difficult decision to end the open door. We wanted to be able to tell you this important news in person, but the times have forced us to be able to come to you right now via video. The open door has been a vital ministry and place of welcome to those in the Bloomington community for more than 15 years. We are so thankful for your unconditional love, your selfless service, and the many ways that you have generously supported this ministry. Our plan is to celebrate the final service of the Open Door at the Buskirk Chumley Theater on May 31st, which is Pentecost, and we will have an amazing celebration. We made a final attempt to revive the Open Door this winter, but we were not able to reach our goals. To be good stewards of our financial resources, we are making this prayerful but difficult decision. The space at the theater has outgrown us, and we now have a remodeled sanctuary that is capable of hosting a contemporary service. We remain committed to a non-traditional, reconciling worship experience that reaches out to our Bloomington community. Starting June 7th, we will alter the worship service schedule for all services at First Methodist. Our classic worship service will move permanently to 9.45 a.m., and we will offer a short communion liturgy at 9 o'clock a.m. We're also excited to launch the journey at 11.15 in the Great Hall. This will be an interactive, intergenerational Bible study that features some music and prayer as well. It will be a way for us to continue to connect over the summer and fall months as we make plans for a new, fresh expression of ministry that will be coming in January of 2021. This is a time filled with change and uncertainty, and so we are very thankful that you are staying connected to God and one another in the steadfast love of Christ. And we give thanks for the many ways that you are sharing that love of Christ with Bloomington and beyond. You are a blessing.